हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू सुरेश अग्रवाल्स मैथमेटिक्स शॉर्टकट्स येट अनदर वीडियो फॉर फास्ट मल्टीप्लीकेशन दिस टाइम आई एम गोइंग टू टेक अप नंबर्स व्हिच एंड इन सेम डिजिट लाइक यू कैन सी सम नंबर्स रिटन हियर 24 टाइम्स 64 दे एंड इन द सेम डिजिट 4 लाइकवाइज 58 198 दे एंड इन 8 एंडिंग इन 6 एंड वी विल एक्सट्रापोलेट दिस मेथड टू मल्टीप्लाई बिग नंबर्स आल्सो सो there are lot many examples after these three examples also so watch the complete video you are going to um, learn this amazing trick and i'm sure this is going to add to your uh, you know already existing set of set of tricks which you might, uh, might be using in uh, uh, cracking these uh, simplification problems and saving time during competitive exams if you have not clicked the subscribe button till now please do it and uh, along with that you need to click the bell shaped icon so that you keep on getting the notifications of all these useful uploads on this amazing channel so let's get going and see the trick first let's understand by taking some basic examples which i have written here and then apply it for higher problems also so the trick goes like this so we know that the number ends in 4 here and so i will write the number 16 4 square is 16 right i'll write 16 now the first part is the product of the remaining numbers that is 2 here and 6 here so i have to multiply 2 times 6 here and 2 plus 6 in the middle but the catch is this is 4 here so i have to multiply this sum by 4 now this is the basic trick which i am going to apply for the remaining questions also so here we have 12 and this is 8 times 4 which is 32 and 16 now retain one digit at a time 6 carry forward the one here so this becomes 33 so 3 carry forward the 3 here you get 15 and so 1536 becomes the product of 24 and 64 likewise suppose i have the second example here where i have to do a two digit number and a three digit number i know that 8 times 8 or 8 square is 64 so i'll have 64 here and then the remaining number is 5 and 19 so in the first part i will have 5 times 19 and in the middle because this is 8 so i'll be doing 8 times what the sum of 19 and 5 which is 24 right 19 fives are 95 and 8 fours are 32 so 2 and 3 so 192 here and 64 here now retain the unit digit 4 carry forward 6 here this becomes 198 so 8 19 gets carry forward so 95 plus 19 is 114 so 11484 is the product of 58 and 198 with little practice this will you know uh, the number of steps you are uh, doing in the mind you know that will also keep on decreasing and uh, so the time will be saved let's take another example of a two digit and a three digit number so 6 in the unit digit here and so 6 square i know is 36 so i'll write 36 and then 8 here and 16 here so i'll have to do 8 times 16 i always write this step so that you know i don't commit the basic error and then i multiply and then i retain the unit digit so three steps i do for carrying out this multiplication and then 16 plus 8 is 24 and i'll have to multiply that by the unit digit 6 now 8 6 are 48 8 4 means 12 and then 6 4 the 24 4 2 means 14 and then 36 so 6 plus 3 means 147 so 7 14 carried means 128 138 142 so 14276 is the product of 86 and 166 right so i hope you got hold of the concept uh, by uh, watching these three examples and after this i'm going to extrapolate it and apply it on three digit and four digit numbers also so let's take this example 74 times 134 now we will be little bit more quicker because we have understood the concept and we can apply it directly so 4 square is 16 right 
Likewise, if I have to do all the questions together, so 7 square is 49, so I will have a 49 here and 8 square is 64, so I will have a 64 here. So last step is very important. Important. If you get this wrong, everything becomes wrong. Now, we have a 7 here and a 13 here and 7 times 13 will get me uh, 91, right? And what comes in the middle? 7 plus 13 is 20 times the unit digit 4, that is 80. And now we can retain the unit digit. So 81 means 1, carry forward the 8 here, we get 99. 9916 is the product of 74 and 134. Likewise, if you see here, this is 4 and this is 21. So 4 times 21 comes out to be 84. And 4 plus uh, 21 is 25 times 7. This is 175 and then 49. So 9, 4 added to 175 gives me 179. So 9 and 17 gets added here. This gives me 101. So 10199 is the required product. Likewise, here you have 6 and 35. So in the first place, I will do 6 into 35. And then if you add them, you get 41 and multiply that by the unit digit 8. So this is uh, 210, easy. And then this is 8 and 32, again easy. And then 64. So 4, the 6 uh, added to 328 gives me 334. So 4 and 33 carry. So 243. So 24344 is the product of 68 and 300. 58. Now friends, you just pick up the calculators and check whether we are getting all these correctly or not because uh, you know, you need to make sure that you are learning the correct thing and the trick is actually going to help you in increasing your speed of calculations. Let's take some more examples. Here we have four digit numbers also you can see and we will apply it here. So this is two square that is four in the unit place. Then in the first place we will have 11 into 74. And then 11 plus 74 is 85 times 2. This will be for the first question. For this, we have a 3 here. So, we will end with a 9. And for the first part, we have 65 into 108. The remaining part of the numbers. And if you add them, you get 173. And you have to multiply that by, uh, in this case, it is 3, right? So, I will have to do it by... 3. And in the last question, I have 6 square which is 36 and 25 and 612. So 25 times 612 and when you add them, you get 637 and times that by 6. Now these are the basic calculations which you need to do. So 740 plus 74, right? This is uh, 4 and then 7 plus 4, 11, 1, 1 and 8. So 814 in the first place and then this is easy 170 and then we have a 4. 4, 0, 17 added gives me 831. So 8, 3, 1, 0, 4 is the product. Likewise, if you see here, 65 into 8 is 130, uh, 260, 520. So 20. And a 5 carry means 70. So I multiplied it already here. And then 3 3s are 9, 3 7s are 21, and 5, and a 9 again. That gives me a 9. Another 9, 51 added here gives me 7071. So 7071 double 9 is the product. Likewise, 25 2s are 50, so 0, 5, 25 plus 5, 30, 0, 3. And 25, 6 are 150, 153. So 15300 is the product. 6, 7 are 42, 2, 4, 6, 3 are 18, 22, 2, 2, 38. 3822 and then 36. So you need to be a little sharp and very quick in your oral uh, multiplication of uh, small digits like single digit with a double digit or a triple digit number, right? Um, 6 comes here, uh, so this gets added here 3, so 3 plus 2 is 5 and then the remaining part 382 gets added here which gives me a 2, a 8, a 6, a 5 and a 1, so 1, 5, 6, 8, 
256 is the required product. So I can go on and on and demonstrate you know how this method helps you. Mostly in 90% of the calculations, you only face two digit multiplications, right? You don't get a two digit by a, a seven digit number or a, or a three digit by a five digit number. Very rarely you confront such numbers. So if you practice three digit and four digit multiplication using this method, then the two digit multiplication is going to be really, really easy for you, right? So I hope this will benefit you and you will put in like one, at least one hour of practice uh, practicing this method so that you can feel comfortable applying it to higher numbers. 30-40 questions should be enough for you and then if you like it, uh, do share it with all your friends and do comment here uh, whether this really helped and really worked or not. All the best for your practice.